know, it's been a real slow week, man. It's been a real slow week. It's been cold. It's been horrible outside. I just want the week to go by just a little bit faster, man. So I'm going to say the introductory for the next part of the video when I go into pit road. This is being cut in half. I just want the week to go by a little bit faster, man. It's a boring week this week. Alright, so I don't know what that was, so I'm gonna leave it there. Like I said, I don't know what that was, but uh, anyway guys, welcome to Career Mode Season 3, Episode 8, I believe. I believe it's Episode 8, I'm not sure, I might have to go back in my channel and just to see what episode it is. But uh, anyway, we're here at Iowa Speedway for the M&M's 200 presented by Casey's General Store. So we're going to go ahead and qualify got the 8 loose setup. And I kind of changed up my paint scheme just a little bit. It's still the same design, but uh, switched the colors around. And it looks kind of better, just a little bit. And the official... Qualifying lap has begun. Oh, almost spun in qualifying. I was able to save it, but I'm not starting in a good position. I want to starting 24th. So I'm going to change that up just a little bit. I feel a little bit tight in turns one and two. So I'll go ahead and switch that up. Looks like Johnny Sauter has the pole. Yep, that's Sauter. And I'm here starting 24th. I've got the outside row. Ah, so obviously, truck really, really loose. So I'm gonna have to make some adjustments here. See how that does. My truck just shot up the wall. Shot right up to the wall, I should say. So that stage got okay, cut in half as to my loose truck when shooting right up into the wall in between turns one and two there. Now look at this, I'm back to where I started, 24th. And I'm going to purposely keep it in 23rd just so I have the inside row to restart. Your stage one winner, Austin Wayne self. I don't think he's won a stage at all yet this season. I'm gonna go ahead and skip that. Alright, be smart out there. Going green. Alright, be ready. 
And green flag waves to begin stage two. Stage two, seven laps. A lap longer than stage one. Get Jennifer Joe Corn on the cab here. They're three wide. Why are they three wide? Right behind me there. Don't mind me, Dad. I just see sparks come up from my truck. Just about three wide here, just again. We're three wide just for a split second. No, we're still three wide. Not three wide anymore. Now this is unusual for John Hunter Nivacek to be. Season 17th. Got Crafton too, that's unusual for him too. For both of these drivers. They're not even in the top 10. Which is quite surprising to me. Because they're always, to me, they're always in the top 10. And they're three wide again behind me. Got the 92 of Timothy Peters. Trying to take me on the out, uh, on the inside, almost that outside there. So like John Hunter Nivacek is going to get some momentum on the inside. He's going to pass me on the bottom. Looks like I got forced into the middle. Okay, so maybe I could blame myself for forcing myself into the middle. Saw that a hole was open, a lane was created, and I just took that opportunity, but that got me nowhere. And if stage two comes to a close, I'll end up finishing 16th. Got zero stage points at all this race. And Brett Moffitt goes on to win another stage. Here at Iowa, I am having quite of a lackluster performance, so this is not good at all. I just kind of... We're sideways again, I'm sideways again. Crash! Coming out of turn two. I instigated it. That's my bad. I'm gonna have to go on pit road to repair that damage, and I do. Stayed in 24th. Oh, I didn't even pit. That's why. So, this is a lackluster performance. Iowa. Iowa has been quite negative to me today. This race has been, this race has treated me negative, negatively. Iowa, 
It's not my cup of tea. I got four to go. I can't. Yeah, this truck is no good. And I just got on the apron on purpose. All right, so I'll go on pit road. <laughs> Repair some damage, and we're oh, we're in overtime. Iowa hates me. Be ready. Ready. This has not been a good performance. This has been lackluster. This is going to affect me outside, tremendously. Outside. And in such a negative way, I'm going to lose probably a handful of spots in the points. I can't find that win. I've been close at Charlotte and Texas. Charlotte and Texas have been really good, but I can't find that win still. This has just been god awful. And I finished 26th, towards the back of the pack. That is what you call lackluster and poor. That is terrible. Bunk down to 10th. Like I said, I probably won't even get my first career win in the truck, my first win in the trucks, probably until Canadian Tire or unless I don't know this is bad unless we go to Bristol but this is just terrible probably do have a couple of angry people mad with me but I did complete the contract so that's good got a message from my mentor. Asker is a contact sport. You are being a little bit aggressive out there, but watch out and clean it up. All right, so I'm in trouble. Austin Hill got mad. He got mad. Joe Nemechek got Nemechek mad at me again. Oh, yeah, he's mad. Now he's upset. Neutral. That's bad. This is this is going from bad to worse this season. So I'll go ahead with the uh, two top fifteens just to make it easy on myself. Gateway is the next race. You know what? Let's see season status. Oh wait, not season status. Uh, reputation. Got Kraft and Forrester and Nemechek upset with me. That, so that's bad. That is bad. So I guess these are my rivals? Alright. You know, I'm gonna, I feel a little bit generous today. So I'm gonna go ahead and do Gateway. I don't think Gateway was. I don't think Gateway is gonna be too good either, man. I've won a Gateway before, in only the exhibition races, the quick races, but I haven't really. I don't know. Nine loose. That's why I got it on. I just completely went onto the track without knowing that I exit out here. I ain't exiting all the way out there.
one to go. Nineteenth. Uh, I don't know. Eighteenth now. Slaughter has a stri second straight pull. Jamie Mosley crashed during qualifying. He's in a backup truck. John Hunter Nemechek gave up qualifying for new tires. And here I am in eighteenth. Just trying to survive. Looking for my first win. Ever in the truck series in career mode. I don't know when that's gonna happen though. I feel like there's gonna be a crash sometime in the series. Yep. I don't have control of my brakes. I'm tight. That's Austin Wayne's self. That's my first altercation with him so far this season. I'm really loose. some good speed on these trucks in the draft but I don't have good handling at all when it comes to a four-star team I'm sorry Austin Wayne self I'm sorry it had to be like that Got by the three of Jordan Anderson. Nice driving that stage. No point. Good job. All right. Still got some work to do. Johnny Sauter won yet another stage. I'm out here just hanging around. Wasting everybody's time. I'm everybody's way too. And everybody hates me. Yeah, come on. Anderson. And I'm around, I'm around. Yep. Stage is over. Finished dead last. Just about dead last. Sauter wins another stage. I'm gonna tighten up my truck just a little bit. Yeah, I, I got good speed, like I said. I got good speed, but the handling is very awful, man. Oh, I got a handful of laps to make up time or make up ground. Stay high, stay high. And they're too slow in these goddamn corners. Move, bitch. Clay Greenfield. 
They're too slow in these quarters. I'm going in there like a fast ass racket. Hold your line, stay up high, stay high, stay high. careful now. Still Move, Kligerman. Hold your line, stay up high, stay high, still there. Fine, now you're clear. See, if you guys are going to be slow, I'm definitely going to move. I'm going to definitely ram into the back of your truck. If I have to move you out of the way in these corners, come on, Nemechek. Go ahead. Go. Move. Push you out of the way. That leader's up there. Whoever's in the lead is up there. Still there. Yeah, I'm gaining up. I'm gaining ground, but whoever that leader is, they're up there. All right. Look at this, Jennifer Joe Cobb. Austin Wayne South hits the wall. I, I don't care if I start a rivalry with Jennifer Joe Cobb. I don't care about her at all. I just lost my voice here for a minute. It's probably because I talk too much in these videos. Lost my voice just a little bit. It was going in, going in and out. Back up at the 16th. My goal is 15th right there. I gotta get past the 7th of Be uh, Corbin Forrester. I'm also Baron Corbin from WWE. So that's my bad. I got 8 to go. This is another lackluster lagging race alright move liberty tax Matt Snyder I want to say Myatt but I think in all reality, it's Matt. Still there. Clear all around. Actually about to go into 13th so if I could catch up to who is this Austin Hill
I, all right, I do want to push these guys, push these guys out of the corner for being so slow. Get out of here. It's like they're purposely slow. Going so slow on purpose. Hey, look at that! I'm, I make up ground in the corners, and I got real tight. And I want to catch up to Dalton Sergeant before this race ends. I doubt I'll do it with three to go. I mean, maybe I will since in these corners seems like I make, like I said, I do make up ground just a little bit. So maybe the next couple of corners. Maybe I'll get at least past a couple of guys up here. Maybe just Dalton Sergeant at the best. And I doubt I'll be able to catch up to him now since my truck is starting to get tight. On these long green flag runs. And don't spin it out. I saved it. But it looks like I'm not catching up to Dalton Sergeant. It looks like I got better speed on the uh, front stretch and back stretch. So. Maybe, uh, like I said, I think the corners are killing them. They're help. The corners are helping me out just a little bit, but uh, when I get uh, on these long straightaways, it seems like they're just pulling away. But like I said, look at this in the corner, though. Make up ground of the corners, but when, once we get onto the straightaway, here, here he goes. His name starts to fade, and he's away. So 13's got at least my goal position. Or a little bit above my goal position. So that's good at least. That was a longer than usual video. I'm going to go check to see what happened between other drivers and myself. So I'm going to go ahead and take a look at this once it loads back in. Like I said, a very lackluster performance at Iowa. Re kind of rebounded at Gateway. Still looking for that first win. So I'm still on a mission here. Let's see. 13th, $23,000, 64 fans. Put you in the wall. I didn't put you in the wall at all. Apologize. Alright, I'll stay off your bumper, whatever. You're still in the corner. Alright, Parker Kligerman likes racing with me. Harrison Burton is defending me. Alright. Harrison Burton. All right.
Reputation. Craft and Forrester and even check are still mad at me. Anyway, this concludes this episode for now. I'm still looking for that first one. And it looks like we're going to Chicago Land for the next race, another mile and a half. It looks like uh, I might end up finishing third again a, a mile and a half. So hopefully I get the job done at Chicago Land. But if not, there's always more races. But anyway, if you guys enjoyed it, give a thumbs up, subscribe as well. I'll be back with the live stream later. Probably a little bit later than usual time, other than 7 or 8. So maybe around 9 Eastern. But anyway, guys, have a good one. And I'll see you guys on the next video and or live stream.